Hi guys, Ash here from CurseForAver.com and this is my tutorial on how to unroot your Galaxy Note 2 GT N7100. So the first thing we do is go to Play Store, search for Triangle Away. Now hit Install, Accept and Download. Just wait for it to download guys. Installing. Now hit open. Uh, hit grant if you ask for super user request. Continue. Download. Now we need to wait for the download to be done. Now hit OK. No thanks. Now tap reset flash counter. Continue. Now wait for it to reboot. So we're up guys, as you can see the flash counter says 1 and the binary status says custom. So if your flash counter says uh, 0 then don't worry just hit volume down reboot and continue on with the video. But if it says 1 or anything more than that go ahead hit volume up and that will go ahead and reset the counter. Now uh, it'll reboot, it'll, the counter will get reset on its own and we are done with the phone part of this tutorial. So let's quickly move on to the PC guys. Just give me a minute. Alright guys, I'm back. So uh, just open up your web browser here and uh, type in www.sammobile.com. Hit enter. And now click on firmware on top. Once the page loads up, there'll be a search bar on top, I mean search box on top. Just type in N7100 hit enter so guys you get a list of firmwares here you just need to scroll through it and select the latest one available for your country slash carrier click download so I've downloaded it already and I have it saved I'll just get that just a moment so guys I have the files here uh, so right now guys if you don't have Samsung keys installed get it from the link in the description and install Samsung keys and uh, once you have Samsung keys installed just go ahead uh, and get the file Odin from link one and then uh, the second one would be a firmware that you downloaded from sammobile.com so uh, once you've done that go ahead right click on Odin and hit extract here okay getting that now right click on the firmware and uh, extract it to a folder extract here or extract it to a folder so this will take a few seconds just wait for it to complete All right, now that's done. So we just need to now open up Odin. All right, that's opened up on my other monitor. Let me get that. All right, now right click on Odin and hit run as administrator. So guys, uh, let's quickly get the phone by phone here. And on the phone, hit down volume, power, and the home button at the same time. Hold it. and now you'll boot into the download mode so just hit volume up to continue and now get the micro USB cable and connect it to the phone so guys as long as you have keys installed properly uh, this will turn blue so now uh, just go ahead and click PDA and navigate to wherever you have the firmware file saved so just open it up and select the firmware file 
it'll be a .tar.md5 file and don't worry if Odin does not respond for a bit uh, you know even when you move it around it might say not responding don't worry it will be back in a few seconds just wait for it be patient